Hello, hi, this is the Leo from Bung Chu Strala. And then today I'm going to show you the connection. Uh, sorry. <clears throat> Hello, hi, uh, this is Leo from Bung Chu Strala. And then today I'm going to show you the training of the connection, communication between the GoWatt SPF 3000 TL model inverter and then and uh, with the uh, Bonjour Solar LIPW uh, lithium battery communication and uh, will be very simple and uh, very match between the GoWatt inverter and our Bonjour Solar lithium battery so now I'm going to show you the detail of the setting and uh, the connection so first of course we need to connect the positive and the negative of the uh, forward inverter normally normally uh, the left hand side is the positive and right hand side is the negative but of course when you make the connection you should uh, uh, check it very carefully no mistake and then the breaker and the, the also the red color connect the positive of the lithium battery and the black color to the uh, uh, negative of the lithium battery. So there is uh, something very important. Is the communication cable? The communication cable for the Gorot inverter. Uh, some of the Gorot inverter. There is uh, some of the Gorot inverter with the BMS port. Normally, normally uh, the, the new model. Left hand side is the BMS and the uh, on right hand side normally will be the RS-485 so uh, we connect the BMS port of the GORT inverter like this and then another port we can connect the lithium battery BMS RS-485 port so this is the Another port, we connect the RS-485 port. So, uh, the connection is ready. And then now I will show you more about the setting of the communication of the GORWAT inverter. Okay, we can see very carefully here. Here we connect the uh, left hand side the BMS port of the inverter and uh, for the battery we connect the RS-485 port so this is the communication port will be very care very, very very simple for the connection okay now I'm going to show you the setting of the inverter so first uh, we enter, we push the enter, and then we choose number five. One, two, three, four, five. And we choose the uh, we choose the battery type. We choose the lithium. Lithium. And then 36. The protocol we can set number zero one and set okay and uh, you can see now if there is the connection here lithium battery and then everything that means the communication is okay so so you can see now here is L I lithium battery that means so that means the communication is very good, it's well done. And then we can make a simple test. We can make a simple test. Is uh, we take off the uh, wire of the communication. Now you can see where for mar with a wire. One second. What will happen? 
So now you can see there is a, a fault number 20, number 04. That means the communication loss. Communication loss. Because uh, we take off the uh, wire, take off the communication cable. So we try to connect it again. Okay. Now we already connect the uh, communication cable. And then we can see the communication can be setting automatically. So that means the communication is very good BMS port. And uh, for the Bongju Zola lithium battery, it's the RS485. So we can see all the information in the lithium battery. So clear. Okay. And uh, this is the training today. We are showing you the uh, setting of the GoWatt inverter and uh, the connection between the GoWatt inverter and the Bongju Zola lithium battery. And uh, the communication is so very simple to make between the GoWatt inverter and the Bongju Zola lithium battery. So uh, this is Leo from Bongju Zola. We are professional for the lithium battery and the solar product. So should you have any question, please feel free to contact us. Thank you, and see you next time. Bye-bye.